Hello everyone, I am Sai Jason here. Welcome back to my channel, Sai Tech Korean. Today we will try to uh, talk about the Samsung Galaxy F62 device. Is it worth us buying the, this kind of mobile phone right now or not? The reason why I am doing this kind of video is because right now, if you are having the HDFC bank credit cards, you can get this phone for about uh, 16 triple nine rupees, as you can clearly see, friends. So, which makes a uh, really a uh, value for this phone. And there are a couple of other things which you need to know about this device as well. So, let's get started, friends, uh, about this phone. So, what are the things about uh, about this phone what i like particularly so first thing i like about this phone is mainly about the display so display is the first main interesting concept of this uh, samsung galaxy f62 so where you can get really good uh, super amulet type colors if you're using in, uh, in this kind of samsung galaxy f62 mobile friends so which is a really good interesting thing so this is what i particularly love about the samsung uh, mobile phones in terms of the display super amulet plus display friends so uh, uh, unless if you are a fan of high refresh rate uh, you can buy another smartphones which are having high refresh rate and amulet panels but samsung panel is always the best panel in terms of the amulet colors and uh, accurate uh, contrast and saturation levels so this is the main advantage of buying the samsung galaxy f62 device for this kind of price range which is offering right now so if you look at the comments and ratings for the samsung Galaxy f62 most of the people they will uh they'll be very much happy with the display at all so uh, all the people uh, they said about the display 99 percent as you can see friends 99 percent were co positive comments about the display no one complained about the display that's a rare case where uh, they got some uh, not good products but apart from that everything is good with the display so next second part which i like about the phone particularly is that the processor the not the processor sorry the battery the battery friends i did forgot about the battery the battery is a 7000 mh of battery so you no need to worry about charging at all so nowadays most of the companies they are focusing on the fast charging technology so whereas the samsung Galaxy f62 has got the 7000 mh of battery so it will uh, take definitely some time to charge but uh, you you will you can use easily this phone for the two days of usage friend without any problem so that is the most interesting thing about this battery backup so if you look at the charging cycles a screen on time on day one day two and day three as you can see friends the screen on time so definitely you can get uh, easily up to or uh, two days of usage without any kind of problems if you're having this kind of monster battery which is a 7000 mh of battery so that is what i like in this particular phone so uh, next even with the battery as well there's not much uh, complaints regarding the battery as well so uh, none of them much complained only few people they complained about charging speed so charging speed takes a lot of time because of the slow fast fast charging rate and the bigger battery so that is what a lot of user complain but no complaints about the battery or draining issues so next let's talk about the processor so for this kind of price range you are getting really good processor friends which is actually present in the premium and smartphones like samsung galaxy note 10 and other smartphones which is a exynos 9825 chipset so which is quite close to the performance of snapdragon 855 processor so you can expect absolutely very good performance in this kind of price range so for 17,000 price range these are the three major factors which i would highly recommend you to buy this mobile phone so first is a display second is a battery backup and third is a performance level the phone is offering right now and these are the few things which uh, are good about this phone and even there are some other aspects like the phone as the 128 gb and 6 gb ram variant you are getting for 16 triple nine rupees as you can see friends for 17,000 you are getting 128 gb and 6 gb of ram so in, even in terms of the camera as well, most of the people that did uh, give the positive update, but overall in terms of camera also, there is not much uh, problem at all friends in this phone. So overall you'll be getting very good decent uh, 64 megapixel camera, which is a quad camera setup. So that's a uh, pretty normal nowadays. So it should be uh, not much problem even with the camera. But there are some other things which are negative about this phone. So uh, even the front camera can record 4K video recording as you can see 32 megapixel front camera. So that's also another advantage. So uh, negative, uh, of impressions like the phone has Gorilla Glass 3 so nowadays we are having the Gorilla Glass uh, 5 production the phone has only Gorilla Glass 3 production that is a one of the drawback uh, which lot of users they did mention second drawback is not having a uh, fast charging 25 watt fast charging is quite okay but uh, if you want to charge 7000 mh of battery at least you should have 45 watts or maybe 33 watts something like that so that is another drawback most of the people complained and uh, third drawback is not having the 5g connection 
absolutely friends now uh, nowadays a lot of uh, manufacturing companies they are releasing phones with a 5g connection so it's better to have the future proof option if you are spending 17000 rupees so try to buy the 5g so that you can use for the next 2 to 3 years in case if the 5g gets developed very fast so this, this are my few thoughts about the samsung galaxy f62 device and for more videos make sure to subscribe to my channel friends i take and this is a quick impressions about this phone and final work did is that uh yes it is worth to buy in case if you don't have any kind of problems with the fast charging gorilla glass 3 production and 4g and 5g so uh these are the few drawbacks and that's it friend this is a quick uh, review on this phone and for more videos make sure to subscribe to my channel site guru and also don't forget to check the links in description and see you in the next video friends until then bye